Yo, what's good, y'all? Welcome back to another video, man. In today's video, we finna go ahead and talk about is she flirting? Or is she just being friendly? Like, does she really like you? Or is she just using you to be in a friend zone? Or whatever the case, you know what I'm saying? So, boom, let's get straight into it. If y'all new to the channel, make sure y'all drop a like and subscribe if you new. First things first, man. Y'all niggas gotta, like, understand that females, are, she already knows, bro. From the time she meets you. From the time y'all even text, from the time y'all exchange words in person, you know what I'm saying? The minute she look at your profile, look at your pictures, all that, man. She already knows she gonna let you smash. She already know if she gonna put you in the friend zone. She already know that if she gonna fuck you for real, she gonna let you crush. And she gonna let you smash. If y'all don't know what crush mean, crush means smash. If you didn't know, you know what I'm saying? For my niggas that don't know what crush mean, crush is another word for sex or smash. You know what I'm saying? A female already knows, bro. Like, a lot of times, you niggas put yourself in a friend zone when y'all come out to a female when y'all first meet her. Y'all coming out friendly, not saying what it is or what it's gonna be like. A lot of females, they like niggas that's gonna take initiative. Like, they gonna show choosing sin. Like I told y'all, females are indirect all the time. Like, they... They indirect, they never gonna tell you exactly what it is. Like they waiting for you to basically close the deal after they throw their little choosing signals. They choose up, flirt a little bit. See what I'm saying? Like they they just they just waiting for you to close the deal to let them know what's going on. That's the number thing. That's the number one thing females desire. Like they desire a nigga that want that tells them what's gonna go on. Like if she don't like what you say, then she can get the fuck out or she isn't going to listen. That's the thing about it. Like, if she like you and attracted to you naturally and she actually want to, like, fuck you or fuck with you, she going to do whatever you tell her, bro, as long as you, like, exert that type of, exert that masculine energy and let her know, like, what's going on. Like, you say it with confidence, she going to listen, bro. Only time she not going to listen is if you got damn ugly or... You're not attracted to she you're not you're not attracted to her or she don't really like you. If a female don't really like you, you're gonna be able to tell her, bro, cause she gonna act masculine all the time. Yeah, I know in this generation, like a lot of females, they wanna be submissive to men. They claim they wanna be submissive to men, but they always act miss submissive to certain men, then other men they act masculine like they wanna be the nigga. Like they the ones with the you know what I'm saying? Instead of having a cat, they they want to act like they the ones with the telling a nigga. Like we, we don't deal with them type of females. And if females like that, like you can get the fuck out. Like we're not doing that. See what I'm saying? We're not doing that shit at all. Like we're not. Well, I'm not doing it. I don't know about y'all, but I'm not doing it. I'm just telling y'all like how they coming. And if she not submissive to you, like that means she don't really like you like that. But you got to be able to weed the difference out with the um, shoes and signals. Like I told y'all, they give y'all little signals, let you know if they on what you on, or if she just attracted. Simple terms, they attracted. But it going deep into detail if she down to fuck, or she just want to talk and it could lead to fucking, or she just want to talk and y'all be like friends to something more happen, or whatever the case. It go deep into detail. Like women already know from looking at you or seeing you in person, body language flirting all that type of stuff like they gonna make it obvious but like i said they indirect so it's up to you to read in between the lines most of the time because females they just want the shit to fall into their lap most of the time they do fall in their lap with most niggas or most niggas just be so desperate be all in their face to make them have a big head boosting their ego but you know what I'm saying? You see what I'm saying? Like, a nigga like me, I, like, it could be a female that look good, and nothing could wrong with her at all, but the minute she starts trying to show that masculine energy, I take her ego, throw it, throw it on the ground, I snatch it like this. Take her ego, have it in my hand like this right here, throw it on the ground, and goddamn just, mm, stomp all over that shit to let them know they're not that important. Let them know they looks is not gone alter my opinion gonna make me act desperate or make me a simp remember y'all always understand that in the end game they want you to they want you to make them submissive to you they want to be a simp for you 
Now, if he mans us out for a different purpose, it's out for a different purpose. That one nigga that's a simp, one nigga being desperate, comfort, giving them comforts, all that shit. That's the average guy type of shit. They want them type of niggas and they use them type of niggas so they can come up off of them. Or so that they can feel better and always keep them in the friend zone. You don't want a female that's gonna keep you in the friend zone or put you there. But like I said, a lot of y'all niggas put y'all selves there coming off meeting a female and y'all being friendly and that that shit doesn't work, bro. Like just stop that shit don't work at all. Like that shit's not gonna get you nowhere. Like they want a nigga that's gonna tell them out to jump. It's okay to get cool with a female, like, talk about, ooh, ooh, whatever, basic shit. But you'll know if she like you if she talking about shit with you or just talking about general shit just to get to know you and you get to know her. But she talking about different dudes around you, like, cut that shit, like, let her know that's not what you there for. And you just sitting there sitting through that shit just being nice because you just trying to fuck, like. Reality check, she not going to give you the cheats, bro, like, because you, so, you being soft. She gonna portray you as a soft ass bitch because when she get to know you, all this stuff is going through her mind like a bunch of different thoughts. And if you allow her to talk about other niggas or other shit that she wanna do or talk to about with other niggas, you obviously not the one she trying to smash. Like, she's just using you as a, what y'all wanna call it? She's just using you as a goddamn person to talk to. Goddamn vent. Basically, that's what it is. A vent. She venting to you. Goddamn. If she, like, being friendly to you, like, on some casual shit, you don't know if she really like you. But like I said, I got to pay attention to the Satanists. Like, females, like, the ones that really want to smash and really want you, like, they're going to be bold. Like, they're not just going to be friendly. Like, say if you talk to a girl in person, y'all not talking about no, like, sexual shit or no, like, flirting type shit. Like, is you just looking at her, look at her body language. Is she standing close to your face? Or is she far, far back away from you, like, all the way in the back, trying to talk to you? Because I ain't gonna lie, like, sometimes if I talk to a female, and I'm not, not saying I'm just trying to fuck with her, but just casual shit, just a basic conversation, or I might say something to her, or she might say something to me. Like, when we talking, if she's sh like, real close to you, like, real close to your face, that's a strong sign that she likes you. If she far, far away, that means she don't want to be around you. Because females going to make you known. Like, they going to stare into your eyes. They going to be looking at your lips. They going to be close to your face. Like, not like right here, but they going to be not more than five to seven feet away. They going to be close to your face. Like, damn, bitch, why are you so close? I done said that plenty of time, time and time again in my head. Like, damn, why this shot is so close to me? And we're just having a basic conversation. They low-key choosing, like, like I said, they want you to close out the deal. Now, sometimes they just be, um, they just be talking just to talk, but a lot of times they be choosing up low-key. It's a free game for y'all. Third thing, y'all just got to learn how to set the vibe. Like, y'all can't wait for the female to, to do it all. Now, it, it sucks that females don't do too much, but they do a little something. Like I said, choosing signals, they... They give you the green light to do whatever y'all gonna do or to get you to move a certain way towards them and make a move on them first. Cause that's what they want. If they always gotta make the move, they gonna feel like they, they doing a man job and they gonna feel like that they gotta be more met going to that masculine stage since they doing what the man's supposed to be doing. Now see, y'all gotta be smart and not take too long. They got down, pick up on the signs type shit. Now, with picking up the signs, you gotta you just gotta make smart judgments, bro. Like you gotta make smart judgments. Now, every judgment might not be the right judgment, but you like I said, you gotta be smart about it. You gotta actually analyze what she's throwing at you. A lot of times it's obvious, and sometimes it's subliminal shit that let her know that let you know that she wants you. So you gotta got down and pay attention. Now we finna talk about friend zone. If you get put in a friend zone, bro, that's the worst place to be. You don't wanna be there at all. Like the friend zone is not it. Now it's possible to get out of friend zone, but if she really, really don't like you, bro, you're not getting out. You're not getting out. 
Now, me personally, I don't like females. I don't let females put me in the friend zone. I don't have friends, like, pretty females that's been my friend. Like, we just cool on some type of shit. I wouldn't try to fuck them. Well, I would, but I mean, like, I wouldn't just try to fuck them. Like, they'd be attracted to where I would smash them if I wanted them, but i just be on some chill shit. Unless they be coming up to me heavy, then I really, like, I apply pressure and say, talk that shit to get, get what I want. But most of the females that I start talking to, like, I make it clear that like, I want you. I ain't trying to be your pal while you go fuck Tyrone. You see what I'm saying? Like, don't be that nigga. Like, with females, I always be a nigga that they could choose on or a nigga that it's a possibility. Or I just let them know off the rip, like, what's going on. Like, I ain't trying to be, like, this and that. Like, y'all gonna got to be dominant and let them know what's going on. You can't let a female be the one to choose and make the rules and shit. Like, you make the rules. If you want what you want, like, make the rules. Let her know what's going on. If she, she's like it or she don't. If she don't like it, then she can got down and get on with her life type of shit. But if you let her make up the rules, then she going to tell you what to do and what not to do. Or what y'all going to be and not going to be. Some shit that'll go through a female mind, she'll be like, damn, this nigga ain't taking no type of initiative. I want a nigga that's going to tell me, like, yeah, we're going to do this and that. But you ain't told her nothing, so she, like, getting bored. She going to ghost you, leave you on red. See what I'm saying? She going to leave you on red because she bored. The truth is, you are boring. See what I'm saying? Now, if she likes you, it's going to be a way different ball game. She going to come off to you nice. She gonna be submissive. She gonna laugh at your jokes. She gonna show body language. Like when y'all in person, she gonna stare deep into your eyes. You gonna see the way she smile at you when you're not even trying. Whether you a funny nigga or whether you a nigga that just make little jokes, little slick jokes here and there. She gonna got them make it obvious like that she interested or like she wanna hear what you got to say. Females is not interested, not gonna listen to you at all. Like they're not gonna hear shit. That a nigga be saying. They ain't gonna hear shit. But when you when you a nigga that she like, or she at least find you attractive at the least. She gonna got down, show you some type of way that she like you. You know what I'm saying? No matter, it's multiple ways she could do that, but she gonna show you multiple ways that she like you. And she touch you flirting, hitting you at work or some shit. Yeah, she like you, bro. No matter what come out of her mouth, she could be like, I don't even like you like that. They just be talking up some shit, bro. Like, see what I'm saying? Like, they always, like, had a clever words, clever ways that they flirt. They just run their mouth, talk shit, but you got to go off the signs. Can't really go off what she's saying, because sometimes, sometimes that shit be cap. 80% of the time, that shit be cap. She really don't like you. She not going to let you touch her back. She not gonna be close to you. She not gonna be in your face. She not gonna stare at you into your eyes. She not gonna be looking at your lips when if you catch her looking. She not she definitely not gonna be touching you or around you. Now up next we got. She if she really like you. She don't mention other dudes. Like females know better than do that. If they pull that shit on you, bro, you gotta ghost her or like step up. Say like. I don't give a fuck and want to hear about that shit. Like, we, we talking about me and you. Like, shut that shit down immediately. If you let her do that shit, she really gonna put you in a friend zone. She gonna be like, damn, this nigga a bitch. She gonna be like, damn, this nigga really soft. Like, he letting me talk about fucking this other dude or going on a date with this other dude, whatever. Like, if you allow her to do all that shit around you, like, she gonna play you. Like, she gonna take the shit on a whole nother level. She gonna be playing in your face, basically, knowing you wanna smash. She gonna keep you in the friend zone, knowing you wanna crack. Never gonna give you the time of day, never gonna give you the chance. I always venting to you about some bullshit, like, ho, well, well, ho, shut up. Like, ho, shut up. Like, I don't care about that shit. Like, the fuck is you talking about? Like, shut your ass up, ho. Like, no, I wanna hear about no other nigga. I didn't hear about you doing something with me. If not, get the fuck out. See what I'm saying? Y'all gotta put y'all foot down. 
females that talk about other niggas around you do not like you or they trying you. If they trying your manhood or trying to see if you dominant or whatever, give them what they want. Put on the little show route real quick to let them know what's going on so she don't lose the traction. But the minute you let her try you, it's going to be the last time, man. She's going to start leaving you on red or she's not, not going to take you serious. She's not going to take you serious. So with that being said, when you first meet a female, you got to come across straight up. You ain't got to get the get to the point immediately. Like, I don't know sexual type of shit, but get to the point. Like express your ideas out within the first day or two or a few days a week. Y'all talking at the beginning stage so she know what's going on. Like I said, you want to set the tone. You want to set the vibe. Don't let her do it because if she do it, she going to do what she want to do. Y'all know how females do. They put you in a female, I mean, in the friend zone, all uh, type of shit, and play games. Like, we ain't got time for that. You want to find out earlier. Damn, I got hiccups. But you want to find out earlier in the game that she playing games and shit. You don't want to find that shit out later after you don't put time talking to this hoe. Hoping that you're going to talk to her or whatever. Woo -woo. And another thing, too, like, don't let females finesse you. Like, when you're trying to get to know them, don't, make, don't let them finish you into thinking y'all always got to go on a date or this and that for you to meet them and get to know them and shit like that all the time. Like, a lot of them females just want a free meal. They know they're not going to fuck with you for real, but the fact that you're so desperate to take them out or see them desperate to link, they're going to make you spend money on them knowing that they're not going to link with you ever again, knowing that they're not going to ever give you the cheats. It's a cold game out here, but that's what, what some of them actually do. They go out to eat with you, do all this and that on a date, knowing that they they're not gonna fuck you that night. They gonna let you drop them off after they, after you done spent hella money on them. Boom, she gonna call up Tyrone to come to her apartment and beat the cheeks in, and not pay for nothing. Like, oh no, fold. She gonna fold the fuck out you. That's why you gotta let these females know. Even a lot of times I got down, I'd be like, let's let's get down, let's do something for free, like let's just get down chill, link. Let me get to know you for real, like let me see if I like you for real before I take you on a date. Then if they be cool with that or they don't, like, oh no, you got to 